I've turned a lot of my attention to uh, the fact that in what I call spiritual warfare, children are targeted like never before. Your problem is you're not connecting all the dots, all the ways in ch the which children are being hurt. Not only these 85,000 missing children that are now in the belly of the largest uh, potentially child sex market in the world. Um, but at the same time that's happening, you have groups trying to uh, get rid of the name pedophile and call them minor attracted persons. At the same time, you're you're sexualizing children, giving them what I used to be, be able to arrest you for giving children. Now teachers in California and other states are giving this in the name of, of liber, liberating children sexually or sex education. And now a 13-year-old can consent to gender mutilation and inject them, have themselves injected with all sorts of chemicals that might ruin their reproductive system. Well, what are you doing? Consent to do that equals consent eventually to, to, to sex with a 50-year-old pedophile. And so if you, you got to connect all these things. And so I, I, for the first time in my life, Jordan, I'm looking at the United States of America and I'm, th I'm saying, look, I used to think I might be out of a job because we eradicated human trafficking. I am now thinking I might be out of a job because the very laws that protect children and allow us to go after their captors are being and will be De de uh, decaying and eroded with this crazy culture that is taking children in the name of liberating them and in fact is enslaving them.